everybody, this is your favorite mapper, Kiev Mapping, here with Kiev Direct. This new show that is definitely replacing that mapping critic thing I announced over a year ago. Announcing new trailers, series, and other cool stuff you would like to hear to get all of you hyped. And also, so that I don't post a billion trailers on my YouTube channel. We have some insane announcements today. We have over five amazing things we would like to get into to show you guys off. First off, before we get into this, I would like to say that this is a parody of the Nintendo Direct, uh, created by the uh, company Nintendo. Uh, I am in no way trying uh, to get in the way of their business. I am just trying to hype up my fans in my own way. Uh, I'm hoping this 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 goes under fair use uh i am in no way trying to infringe on the nintendo brand i'm not i'm not attempting to use any characters or ideas from the nintendo brand excluding uh, <laughs> the idea of a, a of a direct but anyways we're gonna we're gonna get into this now While well, Black Animations is no longer in the community, his collab is still going on, meaning that part 2 of the alternate history of Europe collab is still happening. Since all of the collaborators for this project use different softwares to make their videos, each mapper in the collaboration will have their own map. This is the map that will be used for my episode. I have tried to keep as many elements in Black's map as I could, so I'm sorry if, if this is not perfect. Another downside is that the quality of the video will not be great as the map is very small. However, I'm hoping to create a stronger storyline for my part, considering that this is a black collaboration. Will France stick to the Magadol line and defend the Germans, or may the Central Powers triumph over all of Europe? Stay tuned for Alternate History of Europe Part 2, coming July 10th. This next announcement has been debated on by the majority of my fans, asking the same question in all my recent videos. Where is Viewer Wars? No, Viewer Wars is not gone. I have other projects, so all of you keep your patience. Viewer Wars Part 2 will be coming out after the Black Collaboration, as that is my main priority right now. Two new nations have appeared on the map. How will they fit in? Will they be friend or foe? Find out in the next Viewer Wars, coming out sometime between July 15th and the 20th. One of my old projects has been put under the dust for too long. It was a project I originally worked on, however soon became bored as I ran into several issues. Now, however, I can finally give a definitive date for this shady idea. Alternate future of Oceania has been tricky to make, like mainly because of its geography. Due to the circumstances, this series will not be released until September of this year. Luckily, I have good plans for the series, and I hope you enjoy it. That is all the small announcements we have for today. And now, for a short tutorial by Kiev himself, aka me. Why, why did I say that? Hello, my fellow viewers. This is your favorite tutorialist, Kiev Mapping, and I'm here to give you a couple tips on how you should map. Uh, this is a short, direct, exclusive tutorial. We're going to be teaching you how to fix slide errors. Uh, okay. So, let's just say, we're just going to do a couple things here before we start. First off, this we should go ahead and very quickly add this slide. So, that's done. We have our first slide here. So, let's just say you're mapping and you're like, you, you like to announce. So, this is the part where France announces... And the Soviet Union is coming, so instead we're gonna do something a bit differently. We're gonna say no. We're gonna say actually that's 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 a bit crazy. The Spanish Empire has reformed. Actually, yeah, keep it like that. So now it accidentally says Spanish Empire has reformed. Let's say that just goes past your eyes I, I don't know how that would go past your eyes but uh you accidentally save that as that 
You might be saying to yourself, why don't you just redo the slide? Sometimes you change your borders in a video. Not that I never have these borders. Uh, don't kill me, please. <laughs> but but sometimes borders change and you don't realize a mistake until you've made it. So well, here's what you... So let's say you have this and you're basically screwed at this point. Well, here's how to fix your slide. You go in and place your previous frame. Now, if you have a have any sort of texture like this, then it's going to be a bit more difficult. So you just have to place that. You have to take that off. And so what you're going to have to do here is you're going to have to cut this out. You have to cut this entire thing out. And since this is on the same layer as your text option, it will go ahead and it will be on the same text option. Now here's the tricky part. Here's the very tricky part. In fact, let's undo that for a second. And so if you have a texture like this, I recommend creating an entirely new layer for this texture. So now when you do that, you just have to change it to the texture of that. And then you are good. Look at that. It looks brand new. So now all you have to do is place this behind your thing here. And all you have to do is make your mistake or reduce your mistake. So you just say the Spanish Empire has reformed. Now, you can't see your text now, which might not be able to do because it's off now. <laughs> uh, so yeah, that's how you make how you undo mistakes for uh, mapping videos. I uh, hope you uh, listen to that. Also, part two of Skin Cell series will be released if Wonder Waffle changes his profile pic to that weird anime girl I keep on seeing all over my feed. Welcome back to the direct. I hope you learned something from that tutorial. Now. We are moving on to our some of our bigger announcements. I would like to show you one of our newest trailers for a particular series you might know about. Hit the lights, guys. Alternate Future of Central America plus the Caribbean Part 3 will be the newest installment to the series and will showcase two new mysterious figures looking to claim the throne as the leader of Colombia. Which one will triumph? You will have to see to find out. This part will be coming out sometime after View Wars, most likely late August. So hold your horses guys. And now 
for our last announcement. This is going to be our biggest announcement of the night. That is right, the Canada series is getting a long deserved reboot. Eight months since part three of the old series, this series will of course follow the exact same plot as the old one was supposed to, and will follow a very different format from other videos. The alternate future of Canada series will, all, will follow a different formula, as each part will only be five minutes long, allowing for some quicker video making. This means parts will be quicker to make, I'm excited to announce that Alternate Future of Oceania will be getting the exact same format as Alternate Future of Canada. As you can see, this map is very pol polished compared to its older counterpart, which will allow for cleaner borders, wars, and country malls. Speaking of country malls, they will follow the current Kiev style of country malls. Since the first three parts will go by quickly, the long awaited fourth part may be finished before August, which means four parts of AFOC will come out within the month. That would mean one episode per week. I promise not to become the next Portuguese while about it. Please don't hate me. The first part will be coming out on July 1st, which is only two days from now, so make sure you stay tuned. Well, unfortunately, that is it for all you guys today. Uh, yeah, that's, that's the last thing we're uh, supposed to announce. I Actually, there is one more thing we need to announce. Take a look for yourself. Thank you.